Okay, new uh, model loco review by me here, and this is of the Backman uh, new 9F, uh, number 92233, and this is the uh, heavily weathered version that they brought out, I think, a month ago. And I can tell you, it's an absolutely superb model. Uh, the weathering in particular is the main feature of this, and if you uh, look at the weathering around the boiler in particular, I mean it's absolutely brilliant what Batman have done here. Weathered it up absolutely superb. Um, the only one drawback is there's not really any interior cab detail. Um, a couple of the dials have been um, sort of painted white. Um, I don't know if you can just, you probably can't see there, but there's mouldings in there, but none of like the pipe work or anything like that has been painted, which is a bit of a shame. Um, but anyway, I'll, I'll probably add some Batman crew in there, so a um, bit of a shame. Um, but but the main feature is the um, the external detail, and as I say, the weathering and the main pipe work around here. Um, absolutely brilliant. You can't go wrong with this model. Um, costs one hundred and twenty three pounds, so not cheap. Um, and I guess the extra cost on that is obviously all the weathering that's been added to it. But really, really very, very good, good model. Um, it has got, I don't know if I can zoom in here, if it's going to focus. Possi oh, it did then. Uh, there you go, I think that's 82A, which is um, a Bath Shedco plate. Um, which is great because one of the other things that has come with this model is a Pines Express headboard and it's not on the 9F because if I just bring my other model forward I'll just run it back oh wrong one here we go I've added the Pines Express headboard on the front of uh, 75027 there we go, and that has been really good by Batman to to um, include um, a proper sort of it's not plastic or anything it's proper metallic head headboard there with the 9F um, really really very good because it obviously you don't just have to run your 9F on the freight but you can now recreate a lovely Somerset and Dorset style Pines Express um, style train with the 9F double heading with well, in this case, 75027, which is completely authentic. And as I say, it, certainly if you've got 75027, if you can afford it, get the 9F as well, because both are weathered up. Um, both used to run on Pines Express trains, and if that's the, the sort of thing you're into, um, old train recreations such as um, Pines Expresses, etc., etc., and especially the Somerset and Dorset, this is absolutely brilliant. Um, and as I say, well, just for a bit of extra Somerset and Dorset, I've put 73096 again weathered on the freight just to add a bit of extra S&D touch to it. But yeah, finishing with a model of the 9F, brilliant Batman. Again, I've, I've, I've said it before and I'm sure I'll say it many times again, a winner by Batman here. They've really gone out their way to um, get the, the weathering in particular on the loco. Um, really very good um, spring buffers as well which is always a bonus the coal I'm not sure if that's removable or not um, not totally sure about that um, but anyway let's uh, see the Pines Express um, going around now so 75027 and 92223 on the Pines Express as you can see the 9F also has got a decent motor in it that's going around smoothly and it makes with your Aker Maroon Mark 1's absolutely lovely combination it is really really very good now that what Batman are producing especially with the um, BR standards you've got obviously the standard 5, standard 4, 9F etc etc really very good models by Batman now just 
just uh, look on the 9F a bit more here. As you can see, the uh, as I say, the uh, the motor in it, in it is very good, nice and smooth. Even say even though it's double heading, um, you cannot go wrong with this model if you um, want to do S and D recreations or just running on freight trains or or whatever. The weathering is the main feature of this loco, and it's absolutely brilliant. But what they've done, you cannot go wrong. So, ten out of ten. Well, I'll say nine out of ten, just because there's no really interior cab detail, which is a bit of a pity. But as I say, the, the main feature of this loco is the um, external detail. Um, but yeah, absolutely brilliant and. What a great idea by Batman to produce um, a Pines Express headball with it as well. So that's really, really very good. So anyway, that's my review of the, uh, the new Batman 9F. As I say, I I'd give it 9 out of 10. Um, and another winner by Batman. So well done, Batman. Okay, that's the review. Thanks for listening. Any comments or feedback, please post them to the... Uh, the comments boxes below. Cheers, thank you.